Okay, in this video, I'm going to demonstrate um, uh, how you can do a search for whole words and also non whole words at the same time. Uh, you might wonder why this might be necessary. Uh, let's say, for example, you've got a series of really unique words which you know are only going to turn up a few times, but you've also got some other words that are a bit more generic. Um, but that you would like to be run as whole words to try and reduce the false, uh, the false positives a little bit. Um, so that's what I'm going to show you. So I'm using XWay Forensics 19.0 SR5, the latest release as of um, uh, the tail end of November. And um, what I've done is I've added the standard image to a case and I've refined the volume snapshot as usual to include most things. So in order to do the search, we click the simultaneous search binoculars up here. And by way of demonstration, I'm first just going to do a search for dog um, without any specification on whether to run it as whole words or not. I'm just going to click OK to that. And it will rattle through and find about 400 hits, which it does. So as you can see, dog appears in all sorts of um, peculiar places. So that's a fairly generic term which we might want to run as a whole word only um, so let's just get rid of that for a moment and we'll now repeat the search like this so these first two terms are phrases which I know appear on this image once or twice and are fairly unique uh, anyway um, so there's no no need necessarily to run that as a specific whole word but dog as we already know is quite generic so the way to do a search for both at the same time rather than doing one search for whole words and one search without whole words is to simply tab the word that you want to uh, be run as a generic whole word rather than it being you know any characters found within any string of characters so by pressing the tab key there like so uh, we've got bird dog there and dog tired there which will be ran in their entirety and then dog will only be returned if it's found in isolation on its own but only if well, over here you'll see the whole words only there's actually a three state checkbox so it can be off or it can be on or it can be in its third state which is whole words only if indented so now what will happen when it runs the search is that it will run these first two words as a normal word and then it will find the indent here and so run dog as a whole word okay so let's click OK to that and as you can see the hits are significantly reducing already so 209 so now we can see that dog on its own as, as a whole word is returned but the only other hits would be for dog tired which appears like that and bird dog which appears like that and then all these other hits of dog are whole word only instances um, as opposed to uh, anything else okay that's it